Abia community deserted as gunmen launch attacks and kill many residents. Welcome to the news and thank you for telling me to listen. I don't want to believe that Abia state is wanting to emulate what is happening in Imo state. Imo state is one of the hottest in the southeastern region with Anambra state picking up the hotness and now Abia, what is actually going on? I think it is time the, the leaders or even if the political leaders are not going to come out, I think it is time for traditional leaders and um, a religious leaders to come together and look for a lasting solution to this, um, will I say, killings happening in the, in the southeast of Nigeria. The news in detail, please, stay with us. According to the nation, the gunman also set fire to houses belonging to members of the community during the attack. A non gunman on Tuesday launched an attack on the Amangu Ohafia community in the Ohafia local government area of Abia State, leading to the death of an unspecified number of people. According to the nation, the gunmen also, also set fire to houses belonging to members of the community during the attack. Meanwhile, many residents have fled their homes and deserted the community to seek refuge in nearby villages. Sahara reporters recall that two weeks ago, gunmen killed several persons in, during an invasion of the Abia cattle market in Amomozo in the Okwa West local government area of Abia State. This is not sounding good at all. Now, the fact that something has been underlined, they killed members of the community. Sincerely, I do not think these people, I'm just saying, don't come for me. <laughs> it's not funny. I do not think these people are actually... The eye pop. No, there's nothing you tell me now. Something is fishy going on. I think about last year, they said they caught unknown gunmen. They said they caught them in a video. I mean, somebody captured them in a video and they were like, you know, this, um, uh, even this so called sit at home that they say they are enforced and they have, they have been hijacked by hoodlums. Why I'm still conv convinced that it is not the indigenous people of Biafra is that when these people carry out whatever attack they carry, they try to call Biafra. When you're committing a crime, if you don't want to be caught, you're going to mention that particular group. Like, let's say, for instance, you're going to commit a crime, and in that particular crime, you want to implicate someone, which will mean you want to mislead the police or whoever might be coming after you. Maybe a detective who might want to be on that case. The things you do, like you mention somebody else's name, and before you know it, they start tracing whatever. Meanwhile, giving you the time to, if you want to disappear, you disappear. If you want to, you know, hide, you hide. If you want to run, you run. So at that time, that was when I said, no, now. There is nobody that is going to want to commit a crime and rob it or smear it. Yes, it is true that uh, um, IPOB, sometimes they use in the Boski way. When I mean in the Boski, they come out and they use very heavy words. They use the, the talk tough. They come and they are looked at. That was why I, 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 I'm even saying that they should tone down, you know, this is the Indaboski they are talking about because they will come and say, ah, we do this, so we do that, too. and at the end of the day, they don't ever have the intention of doing, you know, what they say they are doing. Before you know it, somebody hears it and come, come to, to, to do whatever they want to do. And before you know, they are. The indigenous people of Biafra, they threaten to do this, they threaten to do that. And before you know it, you know, innocent people are being killed, innocent people are being um being killed um are being killed before you know it innocent people are being arrested okay nigerian army and police killing the Igbo for nothing referendum is the only way out in nigeria to save lives these are nigerian soldiers police and dia says i am biafran land killing innocent biafrans and you came here to deceive blinded ones so nigerian soldiers become a non-gunman today it's not funny, sincerely. Come out open. Nigeria security attack community killing innocent Biafrans and stop hiding the streets by saying gunmen. Well, uh, this will be said to even the indigenous people of Biafra, even if they come out with that um, your kind of uh, narrative. At the end of the day, If at the end of the day, how, how am I even going to put it? You have to give proof. Yes. Just like, you know, I, I always come out and say, oh, if you say IPOP did this, or if you say them, 
somebody committed a crime, you have to be able to prove that this person actually did commit a crime. There has to be some proof on ground. It's not going to be based on hearsay. So if, you, if you, uh, you're going to come out and say, oh, these are the people that did this, you're going to need proof as well. So that um, we can actually confirm if this is the truth or not. By the date, we already know the Nigeria security personnel burning people's houses in Abia communities. Now, my question to those that go around burning people's houses, who is the, I don't, I don't understand, who are you having issues with? Are you having issues with the, the, are you having issues with, um, how am I going to put it now? Because all I'm, all I'm, all I'm trying, all I'm driving at is, these people at the end of the day, they cannot, I don't think so. I'm not, I stand to be corrected. I don't think these people are actually um, the indigenous people of Biafra. Because even this particular news, unlike other news, they did not accuse them. And this is why I hope them say, like I said earlier, they should be very careful in whatever statements they come out to make. They should be very, very, very careful. Nigerian and me are killing our people. They're disappointed by the long coordination of the U UGM or with the resources who are supporting them. Now they have disguised as a non government to be killing ordinary people. But as always, they will all fail and be exposed. Hmm. A Nigerian policeman, policeman acquired over it. This is war loading my people. This is Fulani and Nigeria security. You wish you stop using this free world war. Something must be wrong. These people can't keep killing themselves all in the name of stay at home. Some people are sabotaging their efforts. Okay. Not gunmen but terrorists in uniform parading themselves as Nigerian security operatives, killing innocent indigenous of Biafra. This is getting out of hand. For those who are laughing at this news, I don't know what the color of your problem is. They speak about what you laugh. They speak about the um, crisis in your country. You laugh. I don't know. I don't sincerely. I don't know. These vampires called unknown gunmen are enemies of Ibo, and we should speak out against them before it is too late. It's military. The video is everywhere online. Burning houses and property because the owners. Of a land acts for freedom. You can burn houses, but can't no burn people. Are you serious now? Well, they're going to. They're, we are going to need more evidence than this. Hopefully, you know, all the stops. This crisis, both the one happening internally and externally. Hopefully, the world allows peace to reign. Okay, on this note, we've come to the end of the news. We say thank you for telling us to listen. Until I come your way next time. Enjoy the rest of your day.